on October 7, 2024, the U.S. Department of Defense announced a major breakthrough in naval operations, the successful demonstration of the Transferable Rearming Mechanism, TRM, at the Naval Surface Warfare Center, Port Wyneme Division. This innovative rearming system promises to transform how warships resupply their munitions at sea, reducing reliance on traditional port visits, and enhancing operational flexibility. The TRM's groundbreaking technology was demonstrated in a real-world test involving sailors from the Navy Expeditionary Logistics Support Group and crew members aboard the USS Chosen, CG-65. The system successfully transferred a missile canister along cables, simulating the reloading of a ship's 41 Malawian Quatches Vertical Launching System, VLS, cell. This capability allows for the rearming of warships while still underway, potentially cutting down on the time a vessel spends in port for munitions replenishment. For the Navy, this means warships can stay on station for longer durations, enabling them to maintain a persistent presence and operational readiness, even in the most demanding environments. The TRM system is more than just a logistical tool. It enhances both strategic and tactical capabilities. Strategically, the ability to rearm at sea allows naval forces to sustain operations without frequent returns to port. This extended operational range increases mission endurance, making it easier for the Navy to maintain a forward-deployed presence without interruption. Whether conducting anti-air warfare, missile defense, or strike operations, this technology ensures that warships are ready to respond at a moment's notice. Tactically, the ability to rearm while in motion enables a quicker response to changing threat environments. It ensures that a warship can stay fully armed and operational in the midst of evolving combat scenarios, without the need to pause operations to replenish missiles or other munitions. This is particularly valuable in scenarios where constant missile loadouts are critical. For example, in high-intensity anti-air warfare, maintaining a robust missile inventory ensures that naval assets are prepared for ongoing threats allowing them to react swiftly without the lag time that would typically be associated with returning to a port or staging base from an operational standpoint the trm presents significant advantages in traditional naval operations warships depend heavily on fixed supply chains which can be vulnerable to disruption by enabling at sea rearming the Navy can extend its reach and reduce its dependence on supply hubs. In contested regions where port access is limited or hostile, the TRM offers a new level of independence. This greatly enhances a task force's ability to operate further from land-based support, reducing vulnerabilities to adversary targeting of ports or logistical routes. Moreover, by decentralizing logistical capabilities, the TRM aligns with the Navy's Distributed Maritime Operations DMO, concept, which emphasizes the importance of dispersing forces across a larger operational area. With the ability to sustain operations independently at sea, the Navy can project power more effectively and maintain presence in areas where traditional supply routes would be too risky or impractical. While the TRM offers remarkable potential, its implementation is not without challenges. First, technical and procedural hurdles need to be addressed. For instance, real-world testing during combat or high-threat scenarios will be essential to ensuring the system works effectively under pressure. The handling of heavy missile canisters across cables, particularly in rough seas, raises concerns about safety and efficiency. Training will also play a critical role in realizing the full potential of the TRM. Sailors must be properly trained to operate the system, and the Navy will need to integrate the TRM into its existing replenishment procedures. This will require significant adjustments to current operational doctrines and logistical frameworks. Looking forward, the TRM could significantly reshape the future of naval warfare. With the potential to enhance both strategic flexibility and operational independence, this new capability offers the Navy a distinct advantage in contested maritime environments. As the Navy continues to evolve its capabilities to meet the demands of modern warfare, 
systems like the TRM will play a pivotal role in shaping the future of naval operations, ensuring that U.S. forces remain ready to respond to any threat anywhere in the world. In summary, the successful demonstration of the transferable rearming mechanism marks a significant step forward in the Navy's efforts to innovate its operational logistics. With its potential to enable at-sea resupply and increase operational endurance, the TRM enhances the Navy's ability to conduct sustained operations and maintain combat readiness, even in the most challenging and hostile environments.